Now, it looks like inflation is going to remain stable for the time being, hovering around the government's target of 2%. This is according to data on consumer prices that was released earlier today. Kim Jian has the details. Consumer prices rose in May, touching the government's target level of 2 percent, an important indicator that the local economy is on the recovery track. Statistics Korea says the consumer prices index ticked up, gaining 2 percent last month from a year earlier. It also climbed 0.1 percent in May from the previous month on the back of rising gas, fish and livestock prices. The prices of clothing, lodging and utilities also rose in May from the previous month, while that of transportation and entertainment fell. Statistics Korea says the government's decision to increase the price of gas by nearly 2 percent in May canceled out its efforts to reduce electric bills. Vegetable prices fell in May on increased supply, but the price of eggs went up due to the recent bird flu outbreak. Statistics Korea said it's not overly concerned about spiking petroleum prices. They surged by nearly 9 percent in May from the same period last year, a slower year-on-year -year rise than seen in May 2016. Korea's benchmark Dubai crude sold at an average price of some 51 U.S. dollars a barrel in May, down one and a half dollars from the previous month. The agency does, however, point to efforts to mediate the adverse effects from rising temperatures, drought and the recent AI outbreak as the key factors that could affect consumer prices in the months to come. Kim Jian, Arirang News.